These injectors are the result of a high level of expertise, both technical and practical. So I did, uh, I was at number two, I was blowing Bosch Motorsports horn, which by the way, I, I could have done for hours, especially after visiting their factory, my God. In any case, now it's time to blow my own horn, which is kind of what I've been doing the whole time, but uh, that's what the internet is for, right? So onto the concept of a, a high level of technical expertise. Uh, I want to talk a little bit about injector dynamics uh, and what we do here and what our capabilities are. Uh, the first thing is that we're here in the injector facility. And uh, if you look behind me, you can see the injector flow test equipment, which probably doesn't look anything like what you think of as injector flow test equipment, uh, because it's not. It was all designed and built in-house. And um, it's, uh, it's completely unique to the industry. Uh, it's very high quality, very high repeatability, and I can say that without question because of everybody in the market who's doing what we do, we have the opportunity to compare our own data with that from Bosch on a regular basis. So unless you think that Bosch can't get it right, well, you know, we're there. We've got, uh, we've got pretty high capability in terms of being able to properly characterize the injector, which is, of course, important uh, for us to even develop them properly to begin with. Now. The one thing that's critical there, uh, and this is a really valid complaint, uh, is that people will say, you know, I don't care about your technical expertise. I don't care what kind of tricks you can do on your calculator or how many spreadsheets you have or that you have MATLAB on every computer in the shop. I want to know what happens on the racetrack, right? Well, uh, that's kind of, a, kind of a dumb approach as well because really what's required is both, a technical understanding and practical experience. And so, uh, we shine in that respect as well. And the reason I say that is we've got, um, I should have counted, I, we have about 10 development cars uh, between the Arizona and the Texas facility. And so uh, I've got cars uh, here in Arizona, everything from, from a Miata to a GT500, a, you know, Cadillac, CTSV, uh, you name it. Uh, and I play with those things regularly. Um, with uh, a stock ECU or an aftermarket ECU. All those cars have uh, Bosch Motorsport uh, data loggers in them. They have lab grade Lambda sensors. Um, they have lab grade fuel flow meters. So I can determine uh, fuel mass or volume per cycle at idle within uh, two tenths of a percent accuracy. There in Texas, uh, it's, it's much more geared towards uh, uh, all out racing with Tony's GTR, I hope you're all familiar with that car. I don't know how you could not be familiar with a 2,500 horsepower GTR. Uh, but in addition to that, you know, there's Stewart's S2000, there's the old Integra there, the turbo, I don't know, 1,200 horsepower Integra. Not to mention all the cars that, uh, all the GTRs that T1 builds on a daily basis. And so, uh, Injector Dynamics offers a level of expertise, uh, both technical and practical, that is unparalleled in the industry. Uh, and it's pretty easy for me to look into the camera with a straight face and say that, uh, or even say that to some of our competitors. We've worked very hard to get to the level that we're at, and we can offer a level of expertise uh, and advice and understanding of the systems that, that literally no one else in the industry can. And the key is that that expertise, along with the expertise of the guys at Bosch Motorsport, is what gave us the X-Series injector.